Hi guys, today we'll be testing out my new black diamond uh, ice pick. All right, this is actually uh, made for climbing ice, but you could also use it for climbing mountains. And one of the reasons I got this um, is that there is a bluffs in the coast over here by my house where we're going to. And some of the area um, to get down to this private beach, it's sort of dangerous. So I was looking for a tool um, that could safely help me. I mean, it's not like completely serious, but this should definitely help me climb down uh, the bluffs a little better because the incline's a little steep. And last time I didn't have any tools and, you know, I was climbing these hills. I mean, they were sort of dangerous if you didn't have any tools. So. That's why I got it, and we'll go and test out um, how well this works. And this could become a very good weapon against wildlife, because at night out here, there's sometimes a bunch of coyote packs. I don't think they'll attack human, but it's safe to have a nice, cool tool like this that you can use as a weapon, and also you can use it as a cane, right? So, which is really nice, especially when you're going down. Um, and we'll go ahead and test this out, Let's see how it works. Yeah, so I've been, I haven't been to these hills for a couple of years. The main reason is that it's dangerous. Some of the path um, is really dangerous. And I don't even know I'm going the right path. But with tooth, this tool, I'll be able to uh, rappel down here pretty easily. So, you can see here, it's gonna really help me sort of grab things when I'm going down. All right? This road's not exactly safe, so they even have the rope, but yeah, working pretty good. Yeah, there's a bunch of rope. Now on the way back up, I'm gonna try to see if this helps me. Now I don't even need the rope. This is really cool. So yeah, in this situation, I would slip without the cane but with the pick, I can use it as a cane. And I think I will probably have to get another one um, to really help it. Then I can use two to go down. So that's, I just wanted to get one to test out. And later on, I'll probably get two. But yeah, take a look at the view here. What do you guys think? All right, so let's go ahead and do the rest of these bluffs. Oh, it's beautiful out here. Um, yeah, one of the reasons I didn't come out here, obviously. Uh, let's go ahead and see. Because it's sort of so hard uh, without a tool like this. But this, this really helps me stay stable while walking those steep hills down. Now, this is going to be the ultimate test. Down to here, it is really easy. Now, to get down to the actual beach, now you have to go through without the rope. This is where it's going to come in really handy and use this to help me rappel down faster. Yeah, this is awesome. So I can really anchor myself here, here. Before I used to grab onto these ice plants and they're not really stable. But yeah, this makes it so much simpler. Um, I wish I had two of them, then I could just, whew, I could go really fast. So I might get another one of these, that way I have two and I could just whew, race down. Yeah, that's so much safer. I got something um, to really help me. All right, especially like this kind of location where I can really just step down. All right, without it, oh man, it's so much harder. That was so easy. The first time I came here, uh, I took the wrong path too. But yeah, we're, this is a private beach by my house. You can only get through this path. But once you get down here, it's really nice. Nobody out here. And boom shakalaka. The Daily City Private Beach. The reason why this beach is private, because the bluffs out, the cliffs out here block it off. All right, and that's up there. Up there is actually where I made that LGV40 video up on the cliffs. And on the other side, it's also, right now it's open, but when the tide comes in, this beach gets closed. 
and the only way out is the way I came through. But one of my dreams is definitely one of the day just be able to rappel down straight from one of the cliffs. That's gonna be really fun. But there's supposed to be a little waterfall. We'll go check out if the waterfall is active today. Yeah, I think people are making some uh, fire here. <laughs> Night fire maybe for that. Holy Jesus! That's a dead seal! Oh, holy Jesus! It's a dead seal. At first I thought it was like some kind of a, a seaweed. And then, and then I saw the tooth. And I was like, damn! It's a dead seal. That's what a dead seal looks like. Okay, and... Ah, there's the waterfall. You guys see it? It's not really a waterfall, but... I mean, it is a waterfall. But it is basically the city sewage pipe going down. Go check it out real quick. Yeah, so this is going to really help me get through the rocks also. All right, sort of help me grip. Yeah, maybe I could just use a cane. Yeah, no, but uh, I'm sure this is going to become in handy when I climb back up. Holy! Whew. <laughs> These locks. Yeah, so this is actually fresh water. I'm coming from the city. And yeah, let's go check out the waterfall. Man-made. Wow, it's a little creek. So this is going to help me rappel down. Well, the rock somewhere. So this is like the hidden uh, waterfall people are saying. So All right, let's see if I can make it through. These guys here. Yeah. Uh, fall in the water. All right. Yeah, so this is in Daly City, near the Nut Muscle Rock. On the jet, just follow the path I went through, and you'll be able to see this water. Wow, waterfall! That's really cool. I might come out here and make some videos later. Check this out. Huh? Almost like a secluded, secluded little area. All right. The water's kind of not really really clean these things are not just rocks everywhere gotta be be careful yeah i'm gonna go ahead and actually rappel up maybe check this out you think i can make it up that hill using this thing okay it's i can't really get a grip oh i, I got a grip yeah this is really helping me just don't fall All right, made it up. We're almost there. Man, it's so deserted out here, man. Just a lot of old junk. It's like walls, leftover walls. Sorry, this is actually turning into a very fun experiment. Looks like a lot of people came out here. Somebody left a can. Lots of garbage. Wow, look at that. That's actually pretty cool looking uh, waterfall. Hi right, guys. I am getting old here. Make it to the waterfall. Up in here. Okay. Whew, look at that. Actually pretty, this is a pretty serious climb. Uh, yeah, the cane really helped me. All right, yeah. Woo! We well, made it. Now let's go all the way up to the top over there. Just be real careful. I think next time I'm gonna bring some gloves. Oy. Okay, use the cane, like that. And go ahead and try to see if I can. That's a lot of some serious exercise. Uh, I got through there. So 
so yeah um definitely helps having this versus not having it the airplane's going by Woo. all right Let's see, can I make this up this steep hill? Yeah, definitely I need two of these. All right, all right, that really helped. Okay, let's try to get behind here. We made it. Oh. Oh. We made it to the waterfall of Daly City. Whew. All right, guys, I'm gonna try to make it back here and see if this works well for, for us here. All right, pretty steep downhill. Um, I'm gonna, I just realized I, I went through the hardest path. I could have just went around. I feel like an idiot, but let's go ahead and repel down this stuff without falling. Pretty wow. Some sand and stuff here. Alright. I'm gonna do some rocks over here. I'll help. Alright. 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 Actually, I'm new at mountain climbing here. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, there's a bunch of baseballs here. <laughs> Left by a bunch of... I fell down the hill. Um, closer look at the waterfall. Take some photos here. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh man. That is pretty dangerous over there. I probably want to go back over there. Yeah, this is all unstable rocks. Over that way. These are Easiest path here. Right. Uh, nuisance. Yeah. All right. All right. It's sort of muddy over here. There, we took the easier path. Why did I go over the rocks? Well, we did get to test out the new ice axe. But yeah, the rocks out here, it's not the safest place to... Oh, great, oh boy. Yeah, how do I get down here? All right, I'll get it, give it a try. Made it. I'm sort of afraid of these rock crushing my legs or something. I'm getting stuck. But I definitely think I need two of these to rappel down and up. Definitely I would recommend getting a pair. This rock log was scary. Let's see if I can make it over again without falling. Whew. Yeah, that was a that was an adventure. Definitely a fun adventure.
Oh yeah. Hi. So this thing does really help on going uphill. Some of these steeper inclines, I can really get a nice grip. But thanks to this ice pick, I can go ahead and climb up these hills no problem. Wow. So, whew. This is where this becomes very useful. I'll undo that. Go up in here without the rope. Oops. Yeah. Get up here. And oops. Oh. I can use to go up this hill absolutely without a rope. Wow, this is very useful. All right, most of the paths are pretty easy, just a few of those very steep inclines. This come in handy. Uh, so, I really like it, definitely would recommend it for everybody out there. We're back to civilization. Normally climbing up those hills would require me to uh, use a rope, but I was able to make it up uh, without using a rope at all. So definitely this can be very useful for mountain climbing. Maybe in hiking, sometimes use it as a cane. Some of the harder inclines, just go ahead and use this as a pick. It's gonna be great. Yeah, overall really loving this uh, ice pick works well for uh, these bluffs out here. Um, I think you do need two of them to really be able to be safer. So definitely, gonna definitely check it out. Yeah.